If you want to separate specific parts of your object, then Blender gives you three possibilities by press the P key and choose separate selection, by material or by loose parts. More about the separate function in this video now. At some point in your modeling process, you will come to a time when you need to cut parts away from a mesh to be separate or you joined objects and want to separate them afterwards again. The only way to do this is in edit mode. It is not mandatory necessary to do in selection, though there are several different ways to separate. You find separate by doing a right click, separate, or use shortcut P, or use the menu mesh bar and go to separate. There you get three options. Separate selection, separate by material, separate by loose parts. I will go through this option now. Separates the selected elements. In edit mode, do in selection which should be separated. I prefer face selection here. Call up the separate menu with one of the previous mentioned methods. Select selection. You will get a selected result like this. Go to object mode, select again the new part and you see it is separated and act as a own object. This method separates fragments based on the materials assigned to the different faces. You will need an object with different assigned materials. I have green, red, white and blue for this one. You don't have to select anything in edit mode, just press P to call up the separate window. Select by material and Blender separates the different materials. Each color will be a new object. Creates one object for every independent fragment which are not connected to each other. For example in object mode you have one single object. So when you enter edit mode and select a specific fragment with the L key, which is the shortcut for linked faces, then you see that there is no edge or face which is connected to the rest of the geometry. It is a loose part. Let's separate them. Press P to call up the separate window and select by loose parts and it's done. Each fragment is split to a new object. This works as well fine with my separated parts with the different materials. Separated by material grades this shape with the blue material and those faces are still one object. Select it again, run again the separate by loose parts function and get three single objects with the blue material. I guess this method can be helpful for exported objects or scenes. That's all so far, thank you very much for watching. It would be very nice to give this video a like and or subscribe to our YouTube channel for more game dev videos. Cheers!